If you find yourself here in Dusseldorf during the European Championship, then you've come to the right place because I'm going to give you a few tips on what you can do here other than watch football and stick around until the end for a bonus tip that will help you save a lot of money. Right now I'm in the Japanese garden. Among other things, this city is known for having the largest Japanese community outside of Japan. Cool, right? This garden was a gift, from the Japanese community to the city, and it invites you to immerse yourself in traditional Japanese garden art. With its numerous cherry blossom trees, ponds, and bridges, the garden offers a fantastic, peaceful retreat. Of course, a big part of Japanese culture is its cuisine, and you can really enjoy it to the fullest here on Immermannstrasse. There are already people queuing up behind me. In my opinion, this is where you'll find the best sushi in all of Germany, so it's definitely worth the wait. Bye bye! All architecture lovers must come to the Medienhafen, where some of the most famous star architects have had the opportunity to let off some steam. This place used to be full of warehouses, which is typical for a port on the Rhine. But today, it's a home to buildings by various architectures. Frank Gehry, David Chipperfield, or Claude Vasconi. It's definitely a great selfie hotspot, but I've made enough of those now, so let's move on to the next tip. We are on the Rhine Promenade, from which you have a fantastic view of modern Dusseldorf, as well as the Old Town. The Rhine Promenade is an absolute gem. Here you can watch the ships drifting on the water, or simply sit back, relax, and enjoy the view. It is the perfect place to enjoy the unique flair of the city and truly unwind. Now that you've had a closer look at the Rhine Promenade, I'll see you on our next location with a new tip. Immerse yourself in the colorful life of Dusseldorf Altstadt, mostly known to people as the longest bar in the world. Various bars around here will definitely be packed during Euro 2024. I'll just wait here while they make my drink, but I'll see you at the next tip. If you come to Germany as a tourist, your cell phone will automatically tap into a local network. But which one will it be depends on your current provider. If you're lucky, you will see our logo. And it is truly the best network in the country with the fastest 5G internet available. But if that's not the case, then I have another hot tip for you. During the European Championship, there are no data restrictions on our mobile network. So if you want to see all the games of Euro 2024, but don't feel like sitting in a dark sports bar and would rather enjoy it in the sun, get a prepaid SIM card from Telecom with the Magenta Mobile prepaid M tariff and watch all the games on your phone. This is our gift to you. Nice. That's it, folks. I wish us all a great European championship and a warm welcome to Dusseldorf.